Hello, hello everyone, and welcome back to XCOM Enemy Within. I'm Peter Moxon, keeper of the Archives, and last time we had our first set of episodes for, for Enemy Within, and it has been a while since then for me, so I need to kind of reorient myself. First of all, facilities. Okay, we have all our stuff built. We have 200 credits from the last mission. Can I make a cybernetics... Not cybernetics, uh, genetics facility. No. Oh, and the OTS is here too, right. Okay. We need power first. In that case, let's start with doing this. So we can work on that and make a steam generator there. Getting an OTS and a genetics lab are probably my next steps, though. Right, we're going to need 200 for that. Okay, and then, uh, no, not cybernetics. Cybernetics we're holding off on. Okay, it's 50 for genetics. 125 for a lab. Fair enough. And then 125 for the OTS. They really want you to, new to use the new stuff, apparently. Okay. So it's 125 for the other two. Yeah, so that's 250, so that's 300 total credits that I want to save at the moment. And if I really wanted to... Getting one satellite, which we do do, actually. I remember that. Oh, we get the council report first. Okay. Satellite in 14 days. Ah, yeah, yeah. We get the satellite before the request expires. And gray market... Don't really have a lot we can sell, but eh, honestly, we have a bunch of sectoid corpses. Maybe. We should Research. Be interrogating the alien subject immediately. I'm confident we can safely house it within the containment facility, but I can't say for how long. Well, we'll do that in ten days, apparently. Oh God, I might have chosen the wrong thing. <laughs> okay, uh, not really worth getting anything there. Getting another satellite could be useful, but that's a hundred credits, and uh, we're trying to save at the moment. Barracks, soldiers, three who are not rookies, and then seven or eight. Yeah. Ah, and our sniper is wounded, that's why, okay. So this next mission might be these three and a rookie. Anyone died? Ah, right, you three. Congrats, you managed to get a kill because it was the tutorial. Oh, let's start scanning. Incoming transmission. Yay! We are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations. And that is not a statement this council makes lightly. Okay, Asia's looking scary, but otherwise we're totally fine. Remember, we will be watching. Yeah, I'm aware. Okay, uh, engineering Human facilities. Arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Okay, so we need to wait on two days here until we can do anything. Uh, let's see. If I want to do labs here, so I can do power here. That does leave this, admittedly. I needed 300 total for the stuff I wanted to build. So I'll start with that. The, the thing is that I want to keep these three open for uh, the, the satellite bonuses. I can do satellite this way, though. So let's go ahead and can we build the OTS? No, not of power? Yep, not of power. Okay. Because I really want to get the OTS... The of their technology. If the aliens were intent on conquering Earth... There's not much we could do to stop them. I'm guessing they have something else in mind. I really want to get the OTS up and running because I want to be able to start getting the squad upgrades. Excavation complete. I did not want to go past that. Okay. Oh, right. Takes time to build, doesn't it? Eight days. God damn. While we're waiting, we might as well start excavating. Spending money, but uh, I can't do much otherwise. 
Okay, four days on beam weapons, eight days on satellites. Eight days is about equal with the construction as well. Soldier back. Okay, we got our soldier, we got the excavation, we did not get a beam weapons prompt. So that means we're still on conventional weapons. Okay. Commander, <laughs> that all happened so quickly I had to kind of parse holodope. it. I've got the coordinates locked in. Okay, scientists, engineers. Let's go for scientists because speeding up research is still really useful, even though 200 credits would also be useful. Yep, don't have that yet. We have our core four. We don't have any weapon upgrades or anything, so, uh, yeah. And yeah, support doesn't have the triple use medkit yet, so so medkit on, on assault still makes sense. Okay. Oh, hey, make items available. This is a thing in the base game. Here, let me do this. There. <laughs> it's just that it was an enemy within thing, not enemy within thing, not an enemy unknown thing. Okay. That's why that seemed familiar to me. Okay, so, so Ray's panic in what was it, Europe and America, Europe and North America, or something. Australia has sent a number of requests for assistance, so that's our next drop site. Local government forces have reported a coordinated alien attack in a densely populated neighborhood. They're counting on us to secure the area. So now they're calling it poison. I'm pretty sure it was acid before. Anyway, Operation Red King. Roger, Big Sky. Reading you five by five. Strike one has the green light for deployment. Okay, we got a decent chunk of map on either side of us. Wait, well, this is an abduction mission, isn't it? Why are we in the forest? Oh, there's like stuff here. Okay. That's different. I don't think that's a meld canister. They have a different look to them. Okay, I'll well, start with no cover, so let's go here since it's full cover against That's one side effective. at least. You there. You there. And you are still a squaddy, so you don't have squad sight, so god damn it. <laughs> Everyone overwatch. Okay, so we know the meld is ticking. Okay, meld in this direction. Ah, there it is. Okay, so there's one meld. Trying to look into the fog, see if there's anything we can notice. I feel like they might have tweaked the Fog of War, because it actually seems like you can see stuff a bit more easily. And not seeing anything. Okay. Let's make our way in this direction. Start with the assault. I'm on it, Commander. Visual on the goods. Okay, four turns to get there. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to yellow move you since we haven't revealed anyone yet and we have the other three units available. Because at least from here, three more turns to get there is doable. Admittedly, getting the assault out of mid here is not great. But I'm kind of hope. Actually, yeah, running gun, I think, lets you still click on the thing. I think so. I hope so. Rolling. This is a disturbing sight, to say the least. Shit. It's hard to differentiate where the organic material ends and the machine begins. It's not going to win any beauty contests, that's for sure. Okay, step one. Can a rocket do something? Nope, rocket is out of range. Okay. In that case, go over here, because it's as close as we can get with blue moves. 
and has half cover. This is the other option, but I'm a little bit worried they can just flank that or something. I'm all over it. Really, there's like a... Oh, I guess because this got in the way. Okay. Can grenade do anything? Nope. In that case, it's either Overwatch or Yellow moved full cover. They have a jump ability. I don't think that procs Overwatch. Which are you dashed full cover at least. The squad side doesn't exist. Okay, not really any good full cover for you. I, there's this, but I'm terrified of popping over here. Let's put you into Overwatch. I'm gonna put the sniper into Overwatch because she can still have she can still be on her rifle. I don't know what the actual range of a sniper rifle is outside of squad sight. Or without squad sight. Please be dumb. Please be dumb. Okay, at least it missed. Elevation's doing me some favors. Okay, gotta jump. Okay, that's doable. And does not trigger Overwatch. Cool. 70%. Okay. You have your arc thrower. I think that does count, actually. Let's try it. Stun is not active, so shoot it. Because of course. Okay, that's all half cover. 24% at the moment. We can go for a flank, though, because this is in line. So around... That should be more than enough for a flank. I'm on it, Commander. And gets us closer to the meld, kind of. Good. Oop, wrong direction. There. Let's go here so we have cover and we're a bit closer. And that was my first mistake. Well, actually, my first mistake was probably moving the, the assault over on yellow move to be completely separated from the group, but this was my first mistake of what we'll get to soon enough. I'm pretty sure that the more ideal scenario here would have actually been to uh, just shoot with the heavy twice because he has bullet storm or bullet swarm, whatever it's called, because 54% by two times is probably more likely to hit than the 64 or whatever we're about to see here. Whoops. 60% and full cover from it if we miss. Okay. At least we have another chance to uh, stun it. Are you dead? You are dead. God damn it. <sighs> Sniper. Wait. Pistol. 95. Fucking die. You know, it occurs to me that if, I've shot with the, that if I had shot with the pistol before and hit, that... The squad might have, or that the sport might have lived. I'm on it, Commander. Okay, I could move up, but we have two turns left on this, so let's go ahead and just overwatch so that everyone else can kind of catch up. Solid copy, Commander. Okay, we are now down to three squaddy. Or, actually, yeah, they are squaddies, aren't they? I meant three squad mates, but squaddies as well, I guess. Okay, so the other meld is over there. Can't currently see it. Okay. Got the goods. Go here for full cover, at least. Sniper has not promoted still. Great. Now. 
We're gonna blue move you, I guess, to half cover. The full cover would be nice, but this is more in line with where we're going. I'm on it, Commander. And then Overwatch. Since we encountered a new alien species, I'm gonna guess there's one more pod. Possibly two, but if so, then they're probably both sectoids or something. Start with this. Can we see? Okay, the meld's over here. That meld better have like three to four turns on it still at the moment. Go Roger, here. Go around back for you, actually. Yeah, it's already a dash, but whatever. Affirmative. Moving out. And Overwatch. Okay, they're in that direction. Good to know. This lets, this lets us go up here. Stay behind full cover since we know they're over here. Mm, two turns left on that. We're probably not going to get it. Both 49s. This one's easier to hit with our assault, so let's go for this one. Free damage, because of course. Can't shoot it. Overwatch. That's full cover, at least. Hold on. We got an indication for over here. That's not a good sign. Let's run and gun so we can try to force them away, though. Because at least this has full cover against them. If I had to hazard a guess... What the fuck?! I'd say the aliens developed this unit with the intention of tracking and isolating single targets. It appears to have a sophisticated evasion system as well. Perhaps we should try to avoid those tentacles. I utterly forgot that that species of alien existed. I I genuinely didn't just didn't remember it at all. 80%. Cool. Game has decided I'm dying this time. Hi. Okay, remember when I mentioned the whole I don't intend to save scum with, the, with this campaign? I'm gonna actually try to do it legit. Red King. Load. Apologies if you're here for integrity. Hold on, if we're this far in, then that means that our, uh, that our support's already dead, yeah. Okay. Well, I can't completely undo my own mistakes, at least. Okay, so now we know there's Meld over here, and that it actually is on, like, a four turn at the moment or something. And we have two pods over here. Let's go ahead, move you up to here. You have no good cover at that point. Let's move you up to here. Copy that. Roger that. Scanning. Let's just go here with you. Funny. Just that everyone's on the same general approach, at least. Okay, since you're the unfortunate one who can't do jack shit, let's go ahead and, like, essentially have you be the semi-sacrificial lamb here. Get you into some higher elevation and cover that is closer. Please don't die. Please don't die. You're still there. Okay, next to that. To have a sophisticated evasion system as well. Perhaps we should try to avoid those tentacles. 
can't go far enough. Can get those. Can I get without the meld, though? Shoot first, you dumbass! You have an ability that lets you shoot and then do a second action. That does not happen if you use a rocket first. Ah! Try going past. Now that that square. Oh, there we go. Suck on this. Okay. Dangerous. But well, let's move you up here. And Overwatch, so we can try to get a cheap shot as they come out of stealth. I. Missed. Crap. Okay. Oh, yeah. Doesn't stop her from getting strangled. Okay, that's all it did, though. Yeah, let's do this. 100%. 80% chance of a crit. Good. Heading out. Since we just have the stealth thing at this point, let's go ahead and just... Pistol or sniper rifle. I say we go over to the sniper rifle because it's more damage and might even be able to one-shot these things. Oh, they're called Seekers. Okay. Meld goes away. Or is that beginning of the enemy turn? Or beginning of our turn? At beginning of our turn, okay. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, two health, whatever. Okay. I think the way this works is that you essentially need to flank the seeker in order to reveal it early. But I didn't remember that it existed in general, so I'm not necessarily the most reliable source of information here. Okay, three overwatches that'll proc the moment it does that, so hopefully someone can get a kill. Thank you. You've got to be fucking kidding me. No, no, everyone else takes a turn here and reloads. You, Overwatch. Still over here? Maybe. Out. Assault would have been a better idea, so we could use a rocket. Oh well. For now, just... Is it any worth for you to just overwatch, actually? Again, no squad sight. I'm gonna try it. You take okay. half cover, at least you can move along this area. And overwatch. Got my eyes on. Uh, two floater pods and a secret pod at this point is really nasty. Well, since we don't have any meld remaining, we can safely just kind of creep forward. Move you up to here, just so we have a slightly different angle and you're closer. You just overwatch. I've got my eyes on. There we go. That Hi, Thin Man. Is unusually human in its appearance. They could be using it as an infiltration unit of some kind. I'd recommend capturing it for further analysis. Okay, bye. I mean, that works. You're in full cover. You get full cover. Oh, I can shoot you? Yeah, 28% chance. Okay, so we know then that we can't shoot you from here with you. So let's get behind full cover. Eh, sure, here. Copy. 
Overwatch just kind of to try to get it to do something else. Like, if it shoots our sniper, that's the worst. Shockingly. Overwatch. Sure, Overwatch. And Overwatch. We're in full cover, and the Thin Man is active, so we'll, ev so we'll eventually move back towards us. Let's move on to this angle. Let's go ahead and move you up to here, at least. Yeah, trust me, game. I know. Eh, still full cover at least. Hi. Thank you for missing. You are not currently earning a promotion, so actually, if we can, running gun... Eh, it's actually that close. 40%. It's full cover, at least, so sure. Let's get you to come up here, since it's still full cover. Kind of wish we had a suppression or something. Let's just overwatch. Everyone's got full cover at the very least. I'm trying to funnel towards my sniper as much as possible. Oh, for fuck's sake. You reload, actually. Okay, so it's probably on Overwatch itself now. Okay, hold on. Ah, uh, no, you have a scope. You're the one that's at full health, so... No full cover. Cool. It is literally just gonna wait there, isn't it? Isn't it? Like here, I'll do this for like two more turns, see if it moves. Yeah, no, it's just standing there. No, fuck you too, then. There. I tried to make that better for all of us, but no. Okay, so we lost our support, which is pretty damn bad, actually. Like, that makes it harder to capture aliens. It makes it so we have less healing later on, at least, like for the mid-game. Uh, in some ways, I kind of wish I would redo it, but I don't... I, I'm not so heartbroken that I need to, like, redo the entire mission or something. So let's just go, and we'll learn for later. KIA. Wait, wait. Our sniper was promoted, yes! Squad's... We consider. Squad sight! <laughs> Almost absolutely fucked that. And you're wounded for another nine days. You were wounded for seven days before this mission. And lightning reflexes. Wow, that would have been useful. I mean, not actually this time, but would have been helpful for me getting to the alien. Okay. So we're down a support. Our sniper is wounded. And we have no other leveled units. We're doing great. Urban Combat Badge. 
Destiny has a special capability for this metal. Rename it and award it to a soldier. What? Uh, floater Autopsy, Thin Man Autopsy, Secret Autopsy. Four Floater Corpses, two Thin Man Corpses, six Weapon Fragments, ten Meld, two Seeker, two seeker Rex. New facility available, Workshop. Yup. Plus four scientists, panic across Europe, panic across Africa, panic in Australia, down by two. We will be in touch, Commander. Okay. Commander, you can now honor our soldiers by awarding them medals for accomplishments you deem appropriate. You can view and award medals in the barracks. Which I will do next time. But that is it for the mission and thus the episode. So if this video hasn't ruined your life, then go ahead and do all that YouTube stuff for a million times. I hope you have a wonderful remainder of your day. I hope to see you in the next one where hopefully we will not have a mission for nine days and we will immediately spend like 500 credits to hopefully get a squad size upgrade and or beam weapons and oh god i'm about to lose aren't i <sighs> oh god anyway see you in the next one <laughs> bye